Hello and welcome back to Hearts Find 4 with our Japanese campaign where we are already in a world war against the Euro Europeans. <sighs> but hey, Czechoslovakia has more, got more fascism. Right, um... Yeah, uh, I'm gonna need some more support, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Just gonna need a lot of getting my people back in line, really. This is gonna be a very uh, odd uh, war, basically. Um, I suspect that I cannot find the right window here. That um, nothing really is gonna happen for the longest time. Um, Because reasons. Um, oh, you're the wrong guy. Uh, you'll do. We don't have any armor right now. Probably should train some. Right. Um, all right, that's one. But yeah, I think we we will not be having a good day, a good time. This, this war is going to depend a lot on what Russia can do. And if they are not doing what they need to be doing, this is going to take probably for, for, for forever. So, can you assume, okay, they refuse to give me Kirin. Okay, that's fine. Kirin is not that great of a province anyway. I need more oil. Why don't I build a few refineries? Because, you know, I need them. There we go. Finish this, finish that. Yes, that means... Thank you, first fleet. There we go. Put some more resources out of the ground. Um, yeah, let's not piss off the commies right now. Because considering that we are... Um, friendly with them. Mm, destroyer models, it's also good research to have. Yeah, they're sinking our goddamn convoys. Um, political power. Yeah, but that's fine. That's fine. Like, how are, how are these straight routes running? Why are they going through the Panama Canal? Why are we going through Virginia? Why am I not trading through there? Make any sense? Can somebody blow up the Panama Canal, please? What the hell's happening? Mexico just decided to split itself in another civil war, which causes more trouble. Wait, I'm at war with Honduras, but they're fully sure. I think that's because the allies technically still exist. Wait, Panama. Why are these... Huh? I think that is because the AI still considers it the allies, so it's the de facto faction that they should join. Well, that's definitely not broken, considering that, you know, your allies is led by a, I don't know, freaking fascist. Which is not really that fond of your, com uh, your, your, your stuff. However, considering that my trade is currently not looking that great, let's... Uh adjust it and trade with the Soviet Union I know it's not ideal but at least it is stuff that you know gets brought in um, nothing that's borders directly hey Korea there you go bank trade with my allies let's be friendly about it Improve working conditions. Get that stability up, motherfuckers. Uh, war support has allowed you to do constant convoy raiding, but that should cease. Um, uh, considering that we are no longer having these long-range convoys. Wait, why is it still going up? Our convoys shouldn't be hit anymore. Can I get this uh, to be explained to me uh, by somebody who understands this? Ok, 
because of what? I don't have any troops here, so where are their convoys going? Wait, what is this trade route with... You're, you're joking. That's how we trade with Russia? Not with, I don't know, this port here? Okay. Sure. That, my dear Freunde, doesn't make any sense whatsoever, to be honest. Um, let's trade with the Dutch East Indies, I guess. It's a bit the closer route. Probably has more dudes involved. How can this be so bad? Alright, well, let's swap you to... And you know the thing? It's probably just um, submarines. So... Uh, that's one more zone that they can do, but that's about it. Right, um... <sighs> yeah. Yeah, I have no idea how we're gonna get through this uh, endeavor, but, um... We're gonna try, damn it. Um... There it is, sinking our convoys left, right, and center. Fuckers. Might be a war to get drawn into. Should. Okay. Sure. The United States is supporting the British Empire through lend lease? I don't wanna just, uh, but, uh, huh. The United States has a war goal against them, but they're still supporting them. I don't want to say that there might be something broken there, but um, I think something's broken there, people. I cannot get anything in and out my nation because how, how, how is these, these roots so bad? I think it's because of earlier things. And it just all kind of goes through here. I don't think it's entirely accurate. This doesn't feel entirely accurate, I think. For at least what it looks like to me. Hmm. We'll see how this turns out. Alright. Uh, there we go. I'm also trying to figure out what the hell I'm going to supposed to do against fighting the UK. As well as... The, oh, you found your Pact of Rome. Sure. Sure, that, 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 that makes a lot of sense. Let's develop the oil fields. Soviet Union cannot move through because there is no land border. The Empire just managed to take Poland. The Polish guarantee. So we're waiting for somebody to attack anybody, and that might lead to the world exploding. So sounds like fun. Uh, I don't want you to have any orders because I don't really want to transfer any of my troops across the anywhere. So. <sighs> All right, how are we gonna do this? Okay. Okay. Who is fighting who nowadays? You're at war with a lot of people. Are you at war with Canada? Right, because Canada joined the common term. I think okay. the big uh, big answer to 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 our to my well, kerfuffledness is basically... Uh, I think the United States needs to get into the war. Which is boring considering, but I, I really don't know how to solve this issue any other way. 
right now. But I use that cancel land lease as to be expected. I probably oops, hitting the mic. Um, probably because I have enough resources anyway. Our production. So Catholic Mexico is actually winning because it's part of the Allies. I still don't understand how some of these nations are now part of the Allies. Considering that they are neutral, I think that's pretty broken. Also, I don't I genuinely dislike this. This makes no sense, and I might... You have a puppet war will focus against the UK. I don't know how you got that. Um, focus on Europe. Something causes that to happen. Poland joins the Central Powers Militarian. You know, we got the Central Powers faction. That's... Is that led by Germany? France has decided to not be in a faction yet. West Pacific Treaty Organization. I really am trying to think of a way to pull this out of the mud and not attack Communist China in the meantime. See, that's something we still also need to do, but that's 23 million people and probably a better economy than I have. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Oh, my civilian economy is superior, but... <laughs> well, that's gonna make a difference. <laughs> How many, um... Oh, great. <laughs> hey, you know that refitting that we've been trying to do for, uh, for, for, I don't know how long? Why? I'm, I'm, I'm not even gonna ask, but, um... Why does that work this way? Because that doesn't make any damn sense. No, does it? Fire development and jet prototypes. And that's, I think, as far as our focus tree basically goes. It's really boring going... Uh, well, it's, I wouldn't say it's boring, it's just not that interesting to go... Uh... It. Oh, we got this guy back. What else do we have? We got some naval research going. Um... Army defense. There we go. It's fine with me. Can I uh, convince you to give me Kirin? Nope. Alright, well. Tr really trying to mentally figure out how to progress on this one because it's boggling my mind right now. Premium Empire returns to Slovakia. So these guys should be progressing down the fascia. There we go. They managed to get um, get into that one. Just hoping that this needs to explode in another direction. That's basically the um, answer, I guess, to the question how to fix this. Um, unions in the army, yeah, because war support is so goddamn low. Multi patriotic speech. I, and there's, I don't think there's a way for me to improve my... Um, my morale, really. Um, We have a lot to add onto this. Just some light batteries. You know what? I'm just gonna produce this thing as is. Um, just to get it done. Just 
to have that thing basically. Um, I don't understand how some of this trading works, but holy crap! No, 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 no. That's oh, one or nothing. All right, well, just give me everything, I guess. Maybe some of it will come through. Well, we've got this uh, guy leading the Netherlands. Yeah, let's see. There's some stuff in here that's actually useful. So let's pick that one up. How are they still sinking my crap here? I have ships patrolling the area that should be harrying these submarines, but it's just we're not even finding them. Like, if you look at the supremacy, we have just a lot more vessels even available, so I don't really get how it's so bad. Our oil situation should be getting better. Ugh, yeah, we're just not getting any resources. I need another friendly naval nation. I think I need to put ships on convoy escort to prevent them from being sunk. Why don't we do change these over to convoy escort injuries? See if that helps any. Sunk something there. Iran, German Empire, Mexican, Iraq. Whoa, 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 whoa. A lot of stuff just happened. And we just sunk a lot of British convoys. So there's some fighting going on here. So submarines, British submarines. All right, so stuff is happening. Romania just joined the allies. That's good. Um, that means that if they joined the war, Soviet Union now has at least a route deeper into Hello there, China. Where did you come from? Okay, I think Europe just exploded. This is good. This will be the end of Italy. I presume that the Soviets can actually pull this off, by the way. That's basically the entire premises of the story. Hey, you joined the Allies? Smart plan. I don't like the name, but that's, you know, what can I do about it? I'm gonna get in two of the... I actually don't need any. Okay. Right, um... What are we looking at here? These are 30 cruiser modifications. So you already have your four cruisers, just waiting for destroyers. Put them in there. This thing has no reinforcement, but uh, it's just a big, f big hitting fleet. That's basically the entire idea, I guess. All right. Well, at least the Soviets can now do something about um, Italy, so that can capitulate Italy out of it. 40 cruiser hull. Okay. Um, research some navy related things. I don't really know what else to do. Don't really know what else to do right now. Hey, we could get war propaganda against the Soviet Union? Well, we'll just do it because um, I need the war. I need my base uh, war support to go up. Uh, seems that our convoy rating is also going down. That's pretty good. But I really need to take a look at research because we're 941. That means we get 941 uh, industry research. We're not up to snuff on a lot of fields, I think. We got four more. Yeah, we got the equipment for them. Building tanks. Yeah, I'm fairly, fairly happy with where we're at. I'm gonna probably stick with light tanks. Considering that the uh, mod adds a few more, we can go to like 1950s light tanks. They're cheaper and they're lighter to use. Um, less fuel, less everything really, so. Okay, we've got some naval results that I couldn't get my hands on, okay. 
I think we're we are now sinking submarines. Good. Yeah, we are. Now for I think for the longest time we're gonna stick with the regular stuff. I will get the new submarines. And then I'm gonna focus a little bit on getting the actual upgrades here. Same story as always, I ignore the biggie ships because I don't care. And, uh, yeah. What's the problem? Convoy rating efficiency is low. Well, considering that you don't really need to raid around here anyway. Let's move you over to where you can do something useful. This is about as close as they can get. And I doubt that's gonna do anything really. Can I make a fleet basing rights for you. Ask for docking rights. I already have the docking rights. So yeah, my 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 subs cannot really do anything. Only thing I can do is check. You import rubber. Uh, you don't, but you import oil. Can I figure out from where? Trade. The United States is... Okay, let's just see who's exporting it. So, might be from Iran? Um, I would war with Iran, right? Oh, that's just not oil, I'm nuts. Uh, cancel this, by the way. It's a bad deal. Um, Grand Mexico, a little bit to the Brits. Um, fifty-six to Italy for Romania, but it's a land route, so that's not going to help me. Iran trades to Germany, France, Italy. That is a land border, but Iran will be. Cut down Colombia. Ah, Iraq. You're not going to tell me that's a direct route that, that they're taking. So, I think if I would be smart, which I'm not, I don't have the range to hit this with these submarines. I would like to hit these three zones. But I don't think I can, because they have no accessible regions, yeah. So I cannot go through this one, because that's... Uh, I need to go through the Panama Canal. I somehow need to get docking rights here, around here somewhere. Or, Haran needs to die. So, we'll, 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 we'll go for the Iran needs to die, torpedo cruisers. I'm wondering if those cruisers are any good, and what it actually looks like. Right, that's about the range of things that I can do right now. I'd rather have that the Russians fight their wars. I'll see how what they do. They'll probably march through Italy and then... Iraq is gonna die as well, so I actually don't need to do the oil thing at all. They're gonna, it's gonna get be basically being taken care of by the Soviets. I could waste manpower here. Maybe I should. As to create uh, more goodwill during the peace deal. You know what? Yeah. Um, this army is gonna... No, no, you are gonna do it. Yeah, you... You're out. Um, get onto the Iraqi border. Right here. And I want you to... Get to the African front, which is an ass front to fight at, but... Defeat at the coast of Japan. And catch the goddamn submarines. German declared war on Cape Commune. <laughs> oh, this might be pretty bad for us. German Empire declared war on the nation of France. Central powers, no faction. Please join. Okay. 
Okay. But you would join the common allies. Good. All right. So luckily enough. Um, okay. So the downside is that. Um, well, no, there's actually no downside here. This is ideal. Uh, Germany has managed to pull in a few more nations against the uh, our enemies. So, all things considered, I think I'm pretty happy with the result. Uh, transport you all over. What's the shortest distance? I think the Nagasaki. Well, uh, technically, it would be if it would put one there, but I don't think I'm gonna do that. A lot of shit gonna get called in. A lot of more enemies. France joined the Allies. Germany, Estonia, Latvia. A lot of crap's happening, but. Let it happen. Um, get these uh, better guns. This is gonna be the end of them, I think. You know what? I'd rather fight on the European front. I'll be honest. Um, hey there, can I get uh, military access through you and through you? Oh yeah, that's fine. Hey, indulge me then. Nice. Let's uh, let's get some waffles, and some chocolate. Is my man bar so low? Might look at script a little bit more. Yeah, well, still it's a quarter of a million, but still. All right, submarine hull, torpedo launchers. Um, that's definitely not the right cruiser for me. Uh, early cruiser hull, get out. Um, you can go. You can go. You can go. Okay, I need to variant myself here. Torpedo 3. Basic snorkel. Torpedo 3. Torpedo 3. And the biggest engine that you have. And skull is as good. So there you go. Start producing these lots. This makes it look a lot bigger. Yeah, but this cruiser hole is wrong. It's the big guns. Rapid fire guns. Light cruiser batteries. Fire gun, light cruiser batteries. You're no longer a capital thing. Not anti air aircraft facilities. Can I get another one? Yeah. Design is too expensive. Really? Torpedo cruiser. I want to take a look at that later, but uh, for now I need to uh, remove this one. Six. There we go. Bam. All right. Um. One tiny change, update. And we recently finished that one, so there we go. What is it, how does this differ, really, the torpedo cruiser? It's just a, a model with more torpedo slots. Don't really care, there we go. Right, um, with that all said, I think construction engineering, eh, you know what, naval production? Yeah, let's do naval production. Let's get that fleet up and running. Because that is my biggest concern right now. I'm also running out of manpower, apparently. Germans did a naval invasion. I assume they have some fleet, but... I didn't expect it to be enough to... Wait, maybe I shouldn't go that early on this one. Um, got this done. Okay, there's a lot of research in this one. Okay. Right, so let's do that first. Japanese are going to town in France, of all places. Oh, we're looking at construction here. We got what we need, basically, so yeah. And my ships are not getting produced due to lack of steel. That's annoying. Um, turn right. British Malaya is the most logical choice. So. Right. We're here. That's uh, good Paris. Lads. Germans did most of the work already, but there doesn't really seem to be a lot of resistance here, so. 
It also doesn't seem to be a lot of Germans here, so why don't we uh, be as it may and Belgium capitulated. Good. Um, the North French border. Keep going. Some Marines. Right. Um, as this is still important, oil from refineries. We're getting more oil right now than we ever did before. Really, it's still very little, but that's gonna be more, right? Yeah, we've got a lot of refineries incoming. <sighs> yeah, sure, I'll sign on aggression packs. Join the anti common turn pact. Yeah. It is something we're gonna do eventually anyway, so might as well go there. German army seems to be unstoppable. Hiroki Haitake is wounded. It's you, I guess? Yeah. This guy is mostly really fat. No, just good, good, good planning. That's not the greatest. Um, just go heavy. I think they have a little bit more stability than they normally do, so they won't surrender just with the fall of Paris. Are we technically, do we consider ourselves at war with France? Because that might be the reason why we're not pushing into France itself. No, 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 we do consider ourselves at war with France. My guy is just a little bit more offensive than he should be. Alright, advanced torpedoes. France capitulated, second armistice is done. Um, but this is still a France that is at war with Germany, isn't it? No, this is a France that is at war. It is a part of the central power, so it's kind of funky that it goes like that. All right. Um, right, so why don't we... Um, ask for military access. Thank you. Go and uh, have a vacation in Italy. Right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Keep, keep a move on. Keep on trucking. Torpedo attacks are always useful. Torpedoes are powerful. Don't think it influences uh, aerial drop or tor torpedoes. I doubt that they even exist in, a, in, a, in any shape, way, or form. Um, I really would like this attack to do this thing. I really like these uh, new troops. I think these are, uh, what you're looking at is the new, uh, these, uh, the modern MI2 troops. How are we looking over here? Uh, if you can take over a harbor point here, I will start raiding the, uh, Iraqi oil. Well, it seems that my submarines are in the area. I never said they're not accessible. They're slightly more badass than I thought. No, they're getting closer. So that's yeah, that is going on. Ah, but they're not performing any really well. So why don't we? Um, I don't know. Just put out stick around. You know, no, no, no. We'll just dock them. Just dock them. It's not going to make any difference if they're active or not. I just want the rest of these ships. There's mostly benefit trying to prevent any uh, stuff from really getting sunk. And this guy can... Okay, doesn't have the range to reach that. Not that one. There we go. So as long as they're in range, the rest of them just focus on escorting and everything. They'll be good. Right. Italy is dying due to Japanese superiority, of course. Who else? Seems our... Convoy, uh, the enemy's convoy rating is not as detrimental to us anymore. Looks good, by the way, these new models. They look really good. A lot more nations now have digital mod historical models, which I kind of like. It's one of those minor gripes that I have with games like this, because I know a lot about equipment and the kind of stuff that was used during the war. And I always get a little bit annoyed if it's wrong or anything like that. I think only this hand here is off because they were just holding it normally on the thing here, but I think that's really difficult to change. 
probably uses the base of the German MP38 or MP40 model. I don't know, what's the, what's the research in this one? Is it MP38s or MP40s? Yes, there is. And gun called the MP38. Germany announced the anti-Soviet pact. Uh, yeah, fuck the Soviet Union, but... <laughs> Look, if we can get help with some royalists, we'll dispose of them later. Nothing wrong with dis disposing some royalists later, isn't there? Alright, so this battle is going in our favor as well. Alright, why don't we uh, add that order in and keep going. Japanese are liberating Venice from itself. Well, um, uh, yeah. Well, that's... This war, all of a sudden, with Germany in here, is going a lot better. Um, they would accept, but there just needs to be a little bit more world tension. So, if we can explode the world a little bit further, that would be kind of great. Let's declare war now. <laughs> Let's not declare war in China. China, with one China policy, might actually cause a little bit of extra... Yeah, because they're going to go and declare another war. Um, that might help. Um, getting the United States in my faction is gonna be the best thing ever. So, hey, we are gaining fuel again. Good. Good, 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 good. Um, yeah, we're fighting a lot of crap here, but we'll slowly and surely bash our heads through there at some point. Um, we are losing some manpower, so let's start recruiting a little bit more. Let's uh, put Luxembourg in. 86. We're, we're, we're close. We're really close to getting a. Uh... Wait, what did you send for? Did, did you want to send volunteers? Really? That's uh, an odd one. I'll accept it, but I don't think I did in, accept in time, but whatever. Just assist wherever the fight. So Iraq capitulated, so that there goes a large chunk of the oil necessary. Ah, uh, you look... Wait, you have a lot of communist influence. Are you growing in communists? You are. What the hell's going on with you there, buddy? I thought you went full fascist, mate. Buddy. But there's still some potential communism going on. What's going on here? What's going on? Common term influence. Ooh, I think their own influence might be towards fascism. No, it's not. Oh wait, these guys might flip over to the common term before the end of the war. Um, stability is a little bit too high. Otherwise, it would start a coup. That would have been kind of great. So we need to just a little bit more. Well, tension. Germany generated a lot. But, uh, it's just, uh, it's just the last bit here. These are bad engagements, by the way. Holy shit. I have a better idea. Let's not do this one. Hold it. Just keep bashing our heads against the... Can I ask them for... No, I can't. So, yeah. The uh, the allies, or so-called allies, are failing. It looks like... Um, the USA just wants in. Um, wait, what, what happened which reduced world tension? What happened? Hmm. If Italy surrenders, that would be great. Um, can I get these nine guys to take over Trieste? I don't think I can, but I can try. Dutch Reich continues Zuider Zee work. Um, can I get aerial staging lights? Yeah, I think I have. Um, like this. Yep. 
These are still fighters, aren't they? Yeah. Why don't we uh, give you uh, the new, improved interceptors? Not a hundred. That's not the number I had them. Two hundred and hundred. There you go. Get them to him, and we'll get rid of these. Even though they're really good. There are no aces. Let's give you also up this to a hundred. Doesn't seem that we can actually deploy our aircraft in uh, German territory. So what I just did doesn't really help anybody involved. Let's just still get the um, numbers going. There we go. Alright, at least some aircraft could be assigned. Um, that reminds me of probably need the modern day versions of it anyway. Or a more modern day. More modern versions of it. I think if we keep up the pressure, we'll be good. Rome has fallen. It's kind of funny that we're still fighting again with the Germans. Jesus, it's 41 minutes already. Um, I'm gonna end the video here. I want to thank you guys for watching.